Hello guys and welcome back to RPG World. Welcome back to ESO. We continue the full playthrough in chronological order. Main mission, zone missions, fighter and magic guild. Uh, we are in Dishan. We just completed the zone story here. Now we do the mage and fighter guilds. We continue them. Let's go to the fighter guild. Uh, the fighter guild is this one. So we can see all colors. Also, we can do the daily. Let's take the daily as well. Uh, what is that guy? Oh. Nice. Provisioning 42. Here you are, my man. I don't want to steal. Good to see you again, comrade. You recall our encounter with Dosha, yes? Yes. When we found her encoded journal? Has been translated. Yes. We called in several favors to do it, but we've cracked her code. In service to her dark master, Dosha was after something hidden in a dwarven ruin, a place known as Mazenelt. Okay. What uh, is she looking for? We're not sure, but it seems to have something to do with that more tomb Vivicus her notes mentioned. Mizenelt is far from here, but I've prepared a portal that will carry us across Tamriel. What do you say, comrade? Venture with me into the unknown? Let's do it. I will open the portal. Takes just a moment. Here we go. Here we go. I remember that from Skyrim. Dosha was no scholar. She did nothing idly. The river has brought us here for a reason. What are we looking for? A treasure of some kind. A potent weapon or an epic spell. Dosha respected only one thing. Power. Whatever okay. it is, we must get it away what from What do you her. think is? The last days of the Dwemer were endless war. Their mages raced to perfect ever more esoteric spells. Ever more powerful weapons. Perhaps the origins of the Vivicus stem from that long gone era. Let's go. What in Nern? The undead are close behind us. We must hide the remains of the weapon. Now! The automatons are still active. We'll die down here! We will see this done, or Morlog Bal's hunters will chew on our bones. Kurano is right. With any luck, the constructs will hold back the dead. Let's move. I still think this plan is madness. Those were ancient ones. Uh, let me... It's in a Dwemer ruin. What went on here? This what's a fucking mini boss. Thank you. 
I expect it to be a bookshelf here. Damn it. Corino is dead. The weapon will be lost forever. No, there's still hope. Osterand will have to do it. Oblivion, take you. I can't. We can still succeed. But you'll have to enact the sacrifice, my friend. Without a soul in the crystal, there will be no way to repair the weapon. It must be done, Osteran. A sacrifice? What did they come here to do? Man, I... They stay too close to me. The skill it took to craft these constructs. Amazing. Just think what this place must have looked like in the time of the Dwemer. Pretty damn big. We barely survived the last wave. Balash is injured. We'll never hold against the dead and the constructs. Osterond is right. You need time. I'll lead the dead away, down another branch in the tunnels. Manath, don't. You'll never survive the swarm. If my death buys you the time it needs. For Deladil and Meridia! Giving yourself willingly to the river's courage. Noble. Yeah, chanting. Only empty shit. More wonders. And a split in the path. Which way shall we go, comrade? Both ways are going on the same place.
Man. What the heck I'm going back? I have big problems with the internet guys. Uh man I think I I, I went the wrong way. This way I need to go. Yeah. A moment. This may be crucial. <clears throat> My love, Asteron, if you're going to do it, you have to do it now. I'm dying. I can't. Don't die on me, Malasha. I can't do this. You must, my love, or Molog Ball has won. It's what she wants, Asteron. This is why we came here. Do it. Goodbye, my love. My Valasha. Valasha's journal remains. Perhaps it will shed more light on what's going on here. We don't read the journals. Another journal? Amazing it's still preserved. May I see it? Here you go. The water begins to clear. Two cities, one warship's Meridia. The other, Molag Bal. <laughs> Abagarlis, the city of the dead, creates a relic to strike at the Meridians. Deladil, City of Light, creates their own weapon, forged around a heart of crystal. Here yeah, from Meridian City, right? Just so. These ancient ones steal into the heart of the enemy with this crystal weapon. They stop the ritual, and their king ends the dark rule of Abagarlis. But they are hunted, so they try to find a haven, a place to hide the crystal. And they come here. You have the right of it. They sought to hide their prize. But the priestess of Meridia first gave her life. She relit the crystal heart so that the weapon could one day be forged anew. So the crystal is here? Yes, comrade. The journals also speak of a tome. Instructions for creating the weapon. The crystal heart of the weapon and the means to construct it lie here somewhere in these ruins. Then we better find them. Here we go. Companion level up, amazing. Good job, companion. Bastian, you level up. Very slow level up, the companions. I can't hold them. You have to go. 
I'm not leaving you. We died when we agreed to this quest. We just kept walking a while. Hide the crystal. Hide the toad. Go! Such bravery in the face of certain death. Yeah. It's a puzzle with these crystals. I need to figure out. Easy peasy. For glory. I need to go this way, but I want to get that book. Dead century, a fitting resting place for my mind. Now just have to hide it. Mm. No. The crystal is in that steam century. We must destroy it. Wait a second. We have a lot of bookshelves here. No skill increase. How dare you, game.
Well done. That's it. Now to Good. leave this place. Wait. Wait. We don't leave yet. Now we can leave. We've succeeded where that withered root dosha failed, comrade. Here, I will open up. Take the crystal and the tome. Give them to Merrick, and he can begin learning what it will take to forge the weapon. Where are you going? I have something I must attend to, comrade. The knowledge we have gained here has flooded my mind. I must mind the river's course. I'm sure we'll speak again soon. Wait for her to leave. I must speak with you. I'll see you down the river, comrade. Okay, wait a second. Ooh, ooh. Please, speak with me. Uh, what? I have only a moment to talk. Why do you keep appearing to me? You're in danger. Danger I can't fully comprehend. Not even in death. What kind of danger? Why can't we talk about this danger? Someone close to you has plans. Plans for both of us. Oh. Plans to betray you. Oh. I am anchored. Contained. Pulled away. Beware, comrade. I will. Weird. Merrick. Welcome back from the depths, comrade. Guildmaster sees all colors told me you'd have something. Yes, we found this stone and crystal. Thank you. I'll begin my research straight away. You'll be the first we contact once I know the details. In the meantime, sees all colors sends her regrets she couldn't stay. She said she had an urgent matter to attend to. You're never content to rest on your laurels. I admire that. Nice. Anyone can pick up. The guild requests your help. Uh Oh, nice horse this guy. Let's do the mage guild as well, guys. Talk with Balaster. Hey, Balaster. Shalador found you. Good to see you again. I've deciphered the spell inside the book. Are you prepared for Sheogorath's first test? Yes, I'm ready. Excellent. It's been fascinating to work with Shalador. Even though he can't read the book, he's been an invaluable resource. I had to decipher layers upon layers of meaning hidden within the tome. Shalador is here. Yes, speak with the Archmage. He's meditating on the challenges ahead. I'm still somewhat drained from my effort, so he'll open the portals to the Shivering Isles for you. Thank you, Valast. Ariel, watch your steps. I'm very excited about this project. Shalador's Sanctuary would be a boon to every mage in Tamriel. Even Guildmaster Vanus approves of our work here. What can you tell me about the book? I'm so glad you asked. On the surface, it's a simple book of nursery stories from the Dunmerland of Stonefalls. But that's just on the surface. There's more. So much more. Each story has hidden meanings, clever references to arcane lore, twisting and turning into the depths of history. It was fascinating to fully unlock the secrets of the book. Sheogorath may be a madman, but he's also a genius. Do you know anything about where I'm going? Not much. We tried to scry into oblivion to get a sense of the place. I couldn't see anything, but I was swept up in a strong sense of homesickness.
What do you want? Hello, Shalidar. The razor is ready. The last prepared it precisely. According to my instructions, of course. What is the razor for? We're having trouble opening a portal directly there. <clears throat> so we created this anchor to help us. Some trickery of Sheogorath's, no doubt. The next time around, I'm sure this won't be an issue. I'm ready. Let's go. beginning to wonder if you'd ever show up. My lord seems to derive amusement from my annoyance. You are here to retrieve a tome for that Shalidor place, Yes, correct? where can find it? Just a moment, mortal. Lord Sheogorath asks that you perform a task first, to prove your competence. He claims to have misplaced a pair of items. Items you must recover. What items? A fork and a staff. Please do try to be quick. My lord enjoys making me wait, but he's not very patient himself. I've opened a portal for your convenience. It should lead you directly to the fork. Okay. I'd say at your leisure, mortal. But I expect I have more time ahead of me than you do. Where this portal take me? My lord is certain he lost his utensil somewhere in Skyrim. It was during a visit to his friend Corthor in Vuldengrav. That was during the Merithic era, I believe. Merithic era. <clears throat> My lord visited with Corthor a very, very, very long time ago. Really? What do they teach mortals these Can days? you tell me anything about this fork? It's an heirloom. My lord is quite fond of it. Has a bit of magic around it too, I think. I don't know. I don't question Lord Sheogorath. What kind of magic? The fork excites and synergizes magicka around it. When held in the hand of someone more notable than yourself, it can produce dramatic results. In your hand, it might be suitable for conveying roast beef to your mouth. Okay, okay. You never forget that smell. A dragon priest's tomb. Ah, okay. No, no, no. I don't want to talk. This the treasures he's collected. Remember me a lot about well. uh, Skyrim. That chest. Perhaps the fork is in there. Move adept. Watch yourself. Ah! Eyes to the sky. Another group. Easy peasy, man. Oblivion, take you. Worthless. No matter what wasted potential. Me there, the ice barrier is down. We can get through. No, man, I don't want to talk, man, I hate this. This is a scribing uh, field. I love it. That was easy. If you play in first person, 
You are like in, in Skyrim. But uh, if you bring third person, you don't see the effects on the ground. Because I like more, honestly, to play Skyrim and... Uh... In uh, first person. Ah, there you are. Easy peasy, man. I'm the Dragon War. Hmm, I see you have the fork. Competently done. I have. Impressive, it. even. Now, for the staff. When last we spoke, my lord recalled the discomfort of Desert Sand. I believe it lies somewhere within Hammerfell, in the dry and decayed hands of Prince Malil. Prince Malil? Prince Malil Alakir, the Sith of Yokuda, a formidable warrior in his day. That was over a thousand years ago, but still. Let's go. As I expected, another resting place for the dead. Shea Gorath has a sick sense of humor. What is this place? This is the necropolis, Asakala. The resting place of Prince Malil, also known as the Scythe of Yakuda. The prince's underlings were clever. They crafted magical seals to guard his resting place. And you know how to get past them? Observe the Yakudan statues. Each bears a crystal in the helm and a seal at the base. The essences you see swirling around in the air here, their energy can be used to unlock those keystones. How do I capture them? Here, I can grant an aura that will allow you to capture the essences as they pass through you. Collect as many of the small ones as you can. They should unlock these scarab seals on the statues nearby. I'll need to consider the other two. This place is incredible. The ancient Red Guards were a noble and accomplished people. What can I tell you, Adept? How do you know all this? What sort of Archmage would I be if I didn't? <laughs> I spent my mortal Good life answer. seeking knowledge of all things, not just magic. Yokudan, or as you know them, Red Guard, culture is no exception. If Balast was here, I'm sure she could tell you the same. Imbue them into one of the scarab seals. Fight? Good. Who dares disturb my slumber? Good. Now 
to collect four more. Wow. to the other seal. Ah! You'll never best my generals. Man, this place is epic. For such a superstitious, mage-hating people, this place is a what work of art. What do we do about the other two statues? Have you observed the sand barriers on those passages in the canyon walls? I suspect the prince's generals may be waiting within. Okay. Their essences would no doubt be more than enough to activate the other two statues. General, how do you know this? Very simple, adept. The seals at the basis of those statues show a scorpion and a spider. Those were the spirit totems claimed by Malil's chief generals. Sadina and Rashomta. Let's let's get them. Easy peasy, my anymore. Man, I love how it's looking this place. It's epic. You'll never reach Malia. Sabina's statue should have the scorpion seal at its base. hum with power go to the center you should find the key to Prince Malil's tomb there wow you dare open my tomb come then and feel the scythe blade impressive voice The whole place here, it's impressive. Guess Haskell will be waiting outside. Let's go. Poor guy. Wait a second. 
Bro, let me check here for more loot. There's nothing here. Another successful retrieval, I see. Yeah. Here the step. Very well, then. I have instructions to have you return to the Isles. My lord would have a word with you. Okay. Ah, right on time. Welcome back. Look, Haskell! Farky's back! Oh, it's so nice to see him again. <laughs> oh, uh, good to see you too, Mortal, I guess. Yes, here they are. Wonderful. I'll just take... <gasps> Forky. Oh, I miss you so much, Forky. Let's never, never be parted again. <laughs> oh, it gives me goosebumps just to hold him in my hand again. <laughs> what about his staff? Ah. The Wabajack! I was sure it's the Wabajack. I've been down in that dusty tube for so long. Say, why don't you clear its throat? Take it in hand and use it on some of these holier than thou temper types. What the hell am I signing up for? Ah, no need to worry, you pretty mortal head. The Wabajack, it unleashes the potential in everyone. The unrecognized essence of artistic beauty that swells and beats within the. Look, you want the book? Oh. Whack some folks with a wabajack! I need to equip it. I need to equip it. How to use it? Equip the weather trap. Wait a second, it's a it's a fucking weapon. Yeah, oh my god. <laughs> I love the Wabajack Jack quest in Skyrim as well man. I transform in the cat in a cat. Frozen. Petrify. Oh. Sheath your weapons. The battle is won. that if I shoot with the Wabba Jack I transform him again and uh, and I transform him with full HP
Holy shit. A bit rusty, but not bad. So funny watching you mortals muck around with things you can't possibly understand. <laughs> I'll be needing that back now. And as promised, Devok. Well, go ahead. Take it. Thank you. Once it's yours, it'll send you straight back to Tavriel. Funny how books have a way of transporting you. <laughs> no. Oh. Simply hold your breath, close your eyes, and count to, uh, let's say, a million. Okay. One, two, three. Okay. Fuck you. <laughs> I love this guy, honestly. I don't believe that magic in itself can be evil. Ah, you've returned. Do you have the second book? Here's the book. Excellent. The Circus of Cheerful Slaughter? Uh, okay. Quite I'll begin my research I think I will equip this. Wait to get to it. What else you have to do here is to do the... We have a daily for a magic mage guild. The main quest is the only thing that remain to do in the area. Well met, Adept. We... Uh, we are in need of... Sort of. Blast has translated Sheagorath's tome, but we're having some trouble understanding it. She may need your assistance. What can I find her? Blast is working the problem out of the Stormhold Guild Hall. See you there, Adept. Wait a second. This is... Uh... The mm. mad god is This is the you land strider. This I will do this in the next area. The Need to mo move in shadow fan. No, sneaking into dominion territory is suicide. I've never credited you for a moment. Need to move in shadow fan. Exactly By the way, the next uh, fighter girls I will take here will be in shadow fan as well. Comrade, a word. Comrade, I must speak with you about an urgent matter. Seize all colors requests you make your way to her as soon as possible. She said she hopes to make use of your prize. She said you'd understand what that meant. She and Aleph await you at the hall in Stormhold. Go well on your path. Not much you don't already know. Every blade's been turned toward the Daedra. Heard a big crew took down an anchor somewhere in Cyrodiil last week. Messy business. Landed right on top of a skirmish between the Pact and the Dominion. This is a prismatic core. Yeah. This too will do in Shadowfern. Basically here we have only the main quest to go. Uh, here in this dungeon and maybe will be more I don't know in this area the main quest but uh, we completed in this area the mage and the fighter guild quest line completed the main area the zone story quest Disham Basically, almost everything done in this sham, of course, except the side quest, completion uh, for uh, trines, dungeons, sky shard, etc. etc. Now we'll focus only the main quest, zone story, fighter guild, mage guild, 
and after that I will come to complete the whole area. We'll focus only the main important things. Thank you very much guys for staying here. Comment below what you think about this playthrough, what tips you have for me in ESO. If you like, if you don't like, like, subscribe if you enjoy the channel. We have a lot of videos, a lot of playthrough. Uh, the playlist on uh, on the channel you can check it and uh, yeah next time we'll continue next episode with the main story in disha thanks for watching see you next time bye